Why has he changed his logo? Why didn't he change his banner? Oh my god, has some of the videos gone missing? Oh my god, is there a new intro on this video? <sighs> Hello! Right, so... I'm back. Again. <laughs> right, if you haven't noticed already, there have been some... Changes to my channel. I mean, if you haven't noticed by now, then you're really not out of turn, are you? <laughs> but yeah, there's probably some people that went on YouTube and saw some completely new channel, and then they click on it and it's me. So some of you might have saw that and been like, "Why has he changed his logo? Why didn't he change his banner? Oh my god, has some of the videos gone missing. Oh my god, is there a new intro on this video?" Yeah, that, yeah, that's probably not what happened. I have no idea what I think my audience are like, but basically. I want to have a little reboot, but when I say reboot, I don't mean like delete my channel and then make a new one and start all over again, forget that everything happened. I mean like, I just want to change what I'm known as, what my channel looks like, and my content-ish. But um, the first reason I want to do this is because, well, TLS Maniac. I mean, is that really a name you want to be known as? Because I don't. I mean, the first bit of it's alright, um, it's just TLS. And if you know me personally, you'll know what that stands for. But for those of you who don't, it's literally, my name is Tom Stevens, and my middle name starts with an L. That's, that's all it is. It's just my initials. It's not like KSI, like, knowledge, strength, and integrity, or whatever it is. Like, it's not like time limit. Satisfaction. What? I don't know. <laughs> it's literally just my name. So yeah, that's very normal. But then you get to the maniac. And to be honest, I have no idea why I came up with maniac. I mean, I've got some sort of memory of why I picked this name. It was just back in year seven, you know, I was I was in that idea of like, oh, I want to be a YouTuber. I'm going to start a channel and have a, like the best name ever. And I used to watch a lot of Vanos Gaming, and if you don't know who he is, he's a gamer, he used to make videos on GTA and stuff like that, and I used to watch quite a lot of them, but then he always played with a bunch of his friends, like he got Died the Nobler, he got I Am Wildcat, and the people like that, but then he got H2O Delirious, yeah, I think, kind of getting the point right, at the time I thought H2O Delirious is a really cool name, and I, can, and I, and I want to do something like that. So I came up with TLS Maniac. Then I remember going into maths and I was like 10 in everyone. And I told one, one person in my maths class, like, I'm starting a YouTube channel. And I told him the name and he was like, yeah, that's a really cool name. You should use that. Yeah. So that's where that name comes from. But then over the years, I got so used to the name that it just, I haven't thought of it being like weird or anything like that. It's only recently that I thought, Right, this is a bit of a weird name now. It's just like I was referring myself to a maniac, but I'm just like some douchebag who sits in his room, plays games, and looks up stuff about Marvel and DC, watches all those films and stuff like that, and I'm referring myself to a maniac. It's like it actually used to be in my email. I remember I went to the bank when I was like 11, probably 11, because I think that's the age you allow the bank card. And the guy we were talking to asked for my email address, and when I told him, he was just like, yeah, you might want to change that in the future. But yeah, I don't want to be walking around the streets and people recognise me as TLS Maniac. It just sounds stupid. So I just thought I'd use my actual name because, you know, it's just... It's like when I announce myself in the video, I'm announcing myself, not TLS Maniac. But yeah, that leads to the second reason I want to reboot. TLS Maniac isn't me. Obviously, I've mentioned in the past I'm into acting, and when I've done plays and like my drama club, and when I did drama in school, when I was given a character, I try my absolute hardest to, you know, be that character. So once I've learnt my lines and everything, every time I go onto the stage to rehearse, it's like I'm getting more and more used to being that character. It's just like when I, as soon as I start rehearsing, it's just I'm that character now. And obviously, when you first start YouTube, you do some like research of what people would want to see and I, um, I got put under the impression that to be a YouTuber you've got to be funny, energetic and all that kind of stuff just to get people to 
like your videos. So yeah, basically what I'm trying to say is every time I recorded a video, it's like I was acting as a different character and obviously like I just said, the more I rehearsed as a character when I was doing drama, the more I get used to it and just instantly turn into that character when I need to. And that's what it felt like every time I turned my camera on, I literally just, you know, turn into TLS Maniac. So yeah, all this time, you've basically just been watching someone else. It's not me. And looking back at my re videos recently, it's just like watching someone else. It's like, what are you doing? Just popping up out of nowhere going, Hey, what's good? You little guys, tears man, yeah. That's not really something I do on a daily basis. So yeah, for now on, I just want to try and get used to being myself in a video. Because also, if I ever became... You know, I'm not saying I will be or anything like that, I'm not saying I'm desperate to be, but if I ever did become popular-ish and people were to meet me, they'd be like, huh, he's really different in real life. I don't, and I don't want that to happen, I want people to meet me and it's like, it's me, no different to how I act in the video. But yeah, then there's the third reason. Um, I just haven't really been happy with how my channel looks and stuff, if you get what I mean. It's just, I like things to be perfect. Like when I'm doing thumbnails and stuff on my videos, I like it to be as perfect as possible. But I've been finding that really hard at the moment because of my colour scheme. Because I chose my channel colour scheme to be orange and blue. Because when my brother made that logo for me, um, the text was orange and blue, so I thought it will make sense. But then it's like, like my latest thumbnail of my last video I did, it would look good, but then the background just makes it look so cheesy and really childish in a way. And then you look at all these other YouTubers and their channel looks so clean. Like they've got a colour scheme of like just like white and red or white and blue or just black and red or something like that and it looks so clean. And then you go to my channel, it's, it's just... But it's not just that, it's just like, with my videos as well, uh, for, all the re for all the previous reasons, like how I act and stuff like that, I get embarrassed when people say to me at school or something like that, Hey Tom, I saw your YouTube channel last night, and every single time I was like, No, don't look at that. And really that shouldn't be like that. When someone says that they look at my channel, I should think like, Oh! Nice, you know, thanks for the support. But then instead I just get embarrassed. And that's that's mainly because of how, like I've said, um, I don't like, I, ha I don't like act like myself and everything, it all seems all cheesy and stuff like that. I make cheesy jokes. And, but then there's also the fact that in school, you know, it's school. One person will see your channel, tell another person, they'll tell another person, they'll tell another person, they'll tell another person, and so on, and it will just spread in through the entire school, and then you get people who just take the piss. I mean, when I say that, I don't mean like they're being horrible or anything like that, it was quite funny when someone take the piss out of me, I had like a whole group of people saying like, because my name's TLS Maniac, I should be calling my audience, Sup Maniacs, how are you doing? And have like, murk of like, me join the Maniacs and stuff like that. It was pretty funny, but then, it just made me think, I don't want me a channel that's just like something to make fun of. I want people to watch my videos and actually, you know, actually find the videos funny and compliment work I've done. Rather than it just being something to point and laugh at. Not, again, not in a horrible way, just... But I don't want that to come across like I've listened to all these people and it's maybe changed the way I think and stuff like that. Because, you know, when you're a YouTuber, you don't listen to those sort of comments, they're just having a bit of fun you just do your thing but then again that's not my thing i don't want to be the guy that makes cringy videos so yeah that's why i want a bit of a reboot i probably missed a lot out it's just really hard to remember what i was gonna say like the reasons i was gonna say but uh the question is now what happens next so obviously by now you've seen that i've changed my name to tom stevens just to represent that it's now me, not a character. I've changed my profile picture to just a picture that I went out and did the photo shoot for, just so it looks a bit more professional. Same with the banner, I've changed that. I'm actually quite happy with what I did with the banner. It was just a normal sized picture, but then I managed to 
proper stretch it out without making me look like a fat lump of turkey or something. And I put the text behind me, so I'm, I'm, I'm really happy why I did my banner. And I asked my brother to make me another logo, so here it is. So yeah, you'll probably see that on t-shirts and stuff like that. There is one thing though, I just sort of get out of the way. I know I've just made my website and everything like that, and it's got like TLS Maniac and all that. Um, I will change that eventually. Like, I'll change how the website looks a little bit, just make it look a bit more professional. I know I've just made it, it's a little bit annoying, but what else can you do? But then the merch store, I'll change how that looks, but I'll leave uh, the TLS Maniac t-shirts and everything on there, just in case if you guys want it. And I'll try and give out discounts whenever I see them. I know I didn't do that last time. <laughs> I've put a lot of my videos on private, just my old ones, just because they're the sort of videos that embarrass me and, you know, seem really cringy and get taken a piss out of. But there's some videos that I really don't get why I did, and it's really embarrassing. <coughs> Not naming any. <coughs> Can I stick my fish fingers in your custard? Girl, you're so perfect. Even a side man can upgrade you. Let's get wibbly wobbly, timey wimey, bangily wangily, sexily wixily. I know I keep saying that, but Jesus, what was I thinking? But yeah, those videos aren't literally gone, they haven't vanished anywhere. They're literally just in private. I'm not sure if I'm going to get rid of any more yet. I've just done the ones that I want to get rid of the most, but I haven't gone as far as my latest ones because I, you know, I've just made them and it, I put a lot of work into them and I don't want to get rid of them just now. And plus there is some videos that I do at myself. Like my latest video, when I talk about GCSEs and stuff like that, I'm I'm sort of being myself a bit more. It's like I'm having a general conversation. And then when I've done like videos with friends, I do act like myself a bit more. But it's just those videos when I'm trying to seem energetic and stuff like that. It's just... <laughs> but yeah, um, now my channel is going to have a different sort of different sort of content going on to it. Like, I'm not 100% sure of what I want to do yet. Like, obviously I still do some of the stuff I have, I've done recently. Like, I've just started the game videos on The Sims and stuff like that. I'll still be doing that. But then sometimes in my spare time, I like to make sort of creative videos. I showed one of them off to you um, on the video when I talk about my new camera. I showed that video I made with the Sea Life Center and all that. So yeah, if I make any more of them, I might upload them onto my channel. I, w I wanna try and do more vlogs and stuff like that because I do really enjoy vlogs. It's just the fact that I haven't really got much to vlog. And sometimes I go away somewhere and I don't think to vlog it until I'm actually there or I've just left. I just think, damn, I could've vlogged that. Or the fact that I don't really wanna do it in front of family and stuff like that. <laughs> you know, it's a little bit embarrassing that you're talking to a camera in front of your family. But then I might be doing sort of lifestyle videos. I know that sounds a bit weird for me to do something like that. I don't mean like sort of fashion and stuff like that. I mean, I, one day I might do something like that. It's just like, you get all these girls doing all that. What about us? What, what about us dudes? What are we meant to do? We just are meant to figure something out ourselves, are we? I mean, there are, I mean, I've, I've seen some people that do it, but it's just... There's not enough! Videos that might be sort of helpful to some people. Like for like for instance, I have just done my GCSEs and I'm thinking at the moment whether to do a video about it or not. Because Well if I do make it you'll find out why. Well I've just finished NCS. I do a video like like telling you the experience I had and whether you should go you guys should do it if you're if you're younger than me and you've been offered to do it. But yeah, actually speaking of that, we do actually have a channel. We've been making videos to raise awareness for mental health and stuff. I've been doing some filming and everything for that. So if you wanna go over and check that out and maybe give us some support, then just pop along to NCS Dorset 2018 Team 6. Thank you. Sorry. It just felt like a good time to plug. But, but yeah, obviously I also made that new intro and I made a new outro as well, which you will see in a bit. Yeah, you look forward to that. I'm, so, I'm sorry if I've, I'm, I'm really sorry if I seem awkward in this. It's just I'm, I'm trying to used to get, I'm trying to get used to being myself. Oh, this is weird. But yeah, there you go. I hope you guys understand why I've, I've done this. I'm sorry if you were enjoying what I was doing before, but I wasn't to be honest. But yeah, I'll see you in my next video whenever that may be and hopefully because of all this and I've finished school and everything, 
I should upload a bit more often. I really hope I, I manage that. <laughs> anyway, TLS Maniac. I'm 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 just I'm just joking. I guess I'll i just I guess I'll keep doing this though. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll be seeing you guys later. See ya!